Hey, folks, I'm your host, The Coach. It's game time. It's ultimate team. It doesn't get any better than this. For this next challenge, you need to complete all the challenge goals to get the win. You can view the goals at any time from the pause menu. With kickoff just moments away, let's send it over to Brandon Godden and Charles Davis. We start this challenge off in the first quarter with three minutes remaining. Still no points on the board. It's 0-0. You've got the ball at the 50-yard line, and it's first and 10. Now he'll be out just a yard or two shy of the 30. Nice job there getting the win. Next up, another challenge, of course.
Hello everyone, you're watching Ultimate Challenges, and I'm your host, The Coach. For this next challenge, you need to complete all the challenge goals to get the win. You can view the goals at any time from the pause menu. Since we're about to get underway, we'll kick it down to Brandon Godden and Charles Davis for the call. Coach, we start this challenge off in the first quarter with three minutes remaining. We're still without a score, tied at zero. You've got possession at midfield. First and short. Seven yards on the pickup there, and it'll leave them with a second and three. Next to receivers, they'll spread the defense out, and they were able to come through with a slashing run. But to that point, it's going to be interesting to see the personnel chess match as this one progresses. Yeah, you're exactly right. Can they continue to create running lanes out of passing sets? And if so, it's going to be a long day for the defense. Six yards to pick up, and that's a first down. One of my old teammates called me the other day when he was watching the game. He said, man, trying to watch an NFL game and trying to account for their passing game? That's difficult. And just when you think you get everything covered, here comes a back out of the backfield. And in this case, he picks up a first down. Congratulations on yet another victory. Now you can go right to the next challenge. If Hey folks, it's the coach here. Welcome back for another exciting matchup in Madden Ultimate Team. For this next challenge, you need to complete all the challenge goals to get the win. You can view the goals at any time from the pause menu. On first and 10, it's Herbert. Let's hit it down to Brandon Godden and Charles Davis for the call. Thank you, coach. We pick up this challenge in quarter number one with less than three minutes left on the clock. You're leading by six points. You have the ball on your opponent's two yard line. So that pretty conclusively, I might add, shows you the perils of going for it and not making it on fourth down. One play, touchdown. Yeah, and I've got to put this on the man in charge. Hey, everybody, welcome. It's the coach with you here today for another edition of Madden Ultimate Team. For this next challenge, you need to complete all the challenge goals to get the win. You can view the goals at any time from the pause menu. They've got good starting field position as they come up here first and 10, right at the 50-yard line. 
Now a throw right side taken in here to start this drive. And all the way in. Touchdown, New York. DJ Moore, 50 yards. And the Jets get the upper hand as they're on the board first here this afternoon. All right, you did it. You got the win. Congratulations. Keep that momentum going and tackle that. Hello there. It's the coach with you here today, and this is an ultimate challenge. For this next challenge, you need to complete all the challenges. Win. You can view the goals at any time from the pause menu. With you for today's game is Brandon Godden and Charles Davis. I'll see you guys again at halftime. We pick up this challenge in quarter number one with less than three minutes left on the clock. Still no points on the board. It's 0-0. But you're just across midfield, and it's second and five. Well, they'll run it here on the jet sweep. Nine yards to pick up there, and it's a first down. How about that there? No frills, no additives, right? Nothing crazy. Just find a way to pick up the first down. A nice run right there. So from the 36 now, first and 10. A throw there, but that's going to wind up incomplete. That certainly appeared to be a play call where they were just trying to make second down, second and short. I think they thought the coverage was off a little bit more than it was. Nice job there pressing up on it and forcing the incompletion. Now pass complete to Moore. And they're going to have another first down as the tackle is made at the Panthers 14. First and 10, it's Patterson. A nice run there, nine yards. And it'll be second down. That's a really nice job by them picking up the run blitz and detecting it and blocking it and turning it into a nice run. And a lot of times you think if you blitz a running play, you're going to smother it. But a lot of the blitzers, they come in a little bit high. They don't have great leverage. Fighting is right in for Jets touchdown. Khalil Herbert, a five-yard touchdown run. And the Jets will jump on top of the game's first score here this afternoon. And that'll just about do it for us in this one. You've notched another win and the next challenge. Hey, everybody. Thanks for joining us today. I'm the coach, and this is Madden Ultimate Team. For this next challenge, you need to complete all the challenge goals to get the win. You can view the goals at any time from the pause menu. On the call today, two of the best in the business, Brandon Godden and Charles Davis. I'll see you guys at halftime. Thank you, coach. We pick up this challenge in quarter number one with less than three minutes left on the clock. We're still without a score, tied at zero. You've got the ball on your side of the field, first and ten. Moore, the motion man right. And they're going to give it to him on the jet sweep. And a good run here as he'll run the other way down to the 40-yard line. That one good for 13 and a Raven first down. An excellent run there coming from out wide. And we used to consider these jet sweeps to be gadget plays or something a little bit unusual, right? But now most teams have some version of this play in their playbook. And I think it's a lot because of the receivers that are being developed nowadays. These guys look like running backs even though they're playing out on the perimeter. First down, right back to Herbert. And a couple of yards as they move it from the 21 to the 19. They went right back to him, but he pretty much had nowhere to go on that play. Well, the previous carry looked pretty good. That one, he was a little tired. I don't know. Yeah, maybe he should have tapped out and had a second back come in and maybe make that run. Who knows? They'll roll him out right. 
He rifles complete. Caught by Moore. And in for the Ravens touchdown. DJ Moore from 19 yards away. And the Ravens are on the board first here this afternoon. Well done. You've defeated this ultimate challenge. Now, if there are stars still available, you can always replay the challenge again. Otherwise, it's time to move on to the next one. Hey, folks, it's the coach here. Welcome back for another exciting matchup in Madden Ultimate Team. For this next challenge, you need to complete all the challenge goals to get the win. You can view the goals at any time from the pause menu. On play action, Allen. Let's join this one already in progress. Here's Brandon Godden and Charles Davis. We pick up this challenge in quarter number one with less than three minutes left on the clock. Still no points on the board at 0-0. Zero, zero. You have possession on your own 30-yard line. And it's second and 10. And this one oh, incomplete. He tried to check it down to his running back and nearly had the ball picked. So back-to-back -back incompletions, and that has him staring at a third and 10. So the shotgun snap to Allen. And that is incomplete. Give him credit for excellent coverage, tight coverage. So first and 10 now from the 30. Allen going to throw. That's Cordero Patterson hauling it in. Room to maneuver at the 35. He may go. And all the way in for the Ravens touchdown. Cordero Patterson. 70 yards, and they are able to strike first here on their opening drive. Well, he's used to running it that distance. Here he had to catch it, too, before making the run. Heck of a play for the score. There's not many things better for an offense than a back who is a complete guy who can run it and catch it, and we just saw him complete a big-time play for a touchdown. Nicely done. And Welcome, everybody. I'm the coach. Up next, another ultimate challenge on EA Sports. For this next challenge, you need to complete all the challenge goals to get the win. You can view the goals at any time from the pause menu. The Raven offense set at the line for this next drive. And, partner, I know so far, and we're still in the first half, but you love this game as a defensive guy. Zero to zero. We'll see if the offense can get going on this drive. Well, you know how they talk about music to your ears? How about what it does for your eyes when you watch something like this, right, where these teams are locked in and going at it, no points going up on the scoreboard. I'm loving it. You're exactly right. Well, switch over, though, to an offensive mindset for a moment. What do they need to do here to get on track and get some points? Well, I think a couple of ways. Number one, you pull out something that maybe they haven't seen before. Coaches there he goes, right side. Now he's loose at the 40, and he's all the way down to the 13-yard line. It's a big play there for Baltimore. 62 yards. A real field flipper there as all of a sudden they've got a first down in the red zone. Now here's a look for the end zone, but that one's going to wind up incomplete. Oh, I like the calmness of how he played the ball here. No panic in his eyes. Is that throw a ride? Tracked it from the moment it left the quarterback's hand, and that's just where he needed to be to knock it away. So now second and ten after the incompletion on first down. And this is caught. Touchdown, Baltimore. Garrett Wilson from 13 yards out. And the Ravens get the upper hand as they're on the board first here this afternoon. Well, on that connection, it looked like they maybe had some pre-play communication. Maybe one of them noticed an area that was open in the defense to get the pass to. When you put the time in, sometimes you have that great silent communication that you just noticed right there because the best quarterback receiver combos in the NFL, they know how to make those adjustments at the line of
Welcome in, everybody. It's the coach with you here today for another edition of Madden Ultimate Team. For this next challenge, you need to complete all the challenge goals to get the win. You can view the goals at any time from the pause menu. The Charger offense set to take over in this battle for L.A. Their defense forced the turnover on downs. They've got the lead. They're in good shape, but can't go into a shell here, right? Still got to be... Herbert has it knocked free. Oh, and one of the linemen on the other side has got it. Dangerous spot for them to cough it up. Lucky to have recovered because when the defense got it, they were already within the shadow of the goalposts. Yeah, and then you're yelling at your own defense. Sudden change, sudden change. That's not what you want to hear on your sideline. That means you've got to run out there and try and stop an offense who has the ball in a very advantageous position. This will be a gain of about eight to the 27-yard line. Fourth quarter, down to the final two minutes, and we've got a one-score game. So it's Charger football as we welcome you back from the two-minute warning. They're facing a critical third down now as they try to hold on to this lead. They'll be in search of eight yards here as they hope to convert the first down. Now it's Herbert. Dancing to his left. And a good job defensively. They stopped him short of the first at the 32. That looked great when he first took off because, in my mind, there was room to run, and he had the marker in his sight. But I certainly didn't expect him to close so quickly, and neither did he. They got to him just in time, and now that forced him to make a decision with his fourth down call. Take it in at the 22. is down the right side. And he's going to take it all the way into the end zone. What a return. And they've taken the lead. And just like that, another ultimate... The coach here, and welcome to this ultimate challenge. Sit back and relax. You're in for a real treat with this matchup. For this next challenge, you need to complete all the challenge goals to get the win. You can view the goals at any time from the pause menu. About set to begin their next drive, the Falcons offense at the line. Oh, he's hit. He lost the football. Put it on the carpet. And now the Rams have got it. Go the other way. He may go. There you have it, another challenge and another victory. Now remember, you can always replay challenges if you left any stars on the table. Hello, everyone. You're watching Ultimate Challenges, and I'm your host, The Coach. For this next challenge, you need to complete all the challenge goals to get the win. You can view the goals at any time from the pause menu. The Broncos onto the field ready to start their next drive. Not only are they in search of their first score, they're in search of their first first down in this ball game as they come up first and 10. And nowhere to run on the interior of that defensive line. He'll get back only to the line of scrimmage. Officially nothing on that last run. They'll try again second and 10. Now it's Wilson. It's Williams on the catch. And he'll be brought down shy of the 40 at the 38-yard line. They'll get only three there, so it leaves him with a third and seven ahead. Good reactions there defensively. That screen was a little slow in developing, and they shut that one down with a little gain. On third down, Wilson. Escaping the pressure right. And he will slide to a stop. He does have the first down. Opted to run for it. The decision a good one. Picking up the first, getting 14 yards on the scramble. On first and 10, it's Wilson. Eluding the pressure right. And he'll avoid the tackle there with a slide. 
He'll get just a yard on the scramble. It's second down. And that's an early scramble that can be viewed positively by either side. From the offensive point of view, it begins to establish him as a possibility to keep it on certain plays. And defensively, they avoided giving up a huge play in one of their... And he can't find anywhere to go with it, and he goes down. Now a timeout called for by the defense, and that's their second charge timeout here in this first quarter. They're down to one remaining. is the target incomplete. One first down here, and that's all, folks. Good work by this defense to hold things in check and force a punting situation. Dixon, the punter, is on as he sends it away. And no return possible here as they angle this one out of bounds. So out come the Rams now for their first possession. They'll be led out by the first Wyoming quarterback to go in the first round, standing 6-5, it's Josh Allen. And in this league, there are many quarterbacks who have their most success running the ball, while there are others who have big arms. There aren't too many guys who can do both, and at the end of many games, this guy leads his team not just in passing, but in rushing as well. So from the 39 now, they'll come up on a first and 10. Throwing now is Allen. First score here this afternoon. Moody good with the extra point. And it's now a 7 0 game. So they only needed three plays on that drive. And the result for the Rams a touchdown. Be taken down here as the first quarter of play will come to an end. Nice job there getting the win. Next up, another challenge, of course. Thank you. 